Kevin, good to have you with us. How does it feel to be a Fulham player? Well, it's been a, a long few weeks for, for me and uh, I think for the club and uh, I'm happy to be finally here, um, a Fulham football club player. Does that make it uh, all the better when it finally gets across the line? Yes, finally. It's a, it's a relief and now I can focus on my goals, on the club's goals and um, yeah, help the team to be successful. Tell us about yourself as a player, because I know you're a right back by trade, but you're an attacking player as well, aren't you? Yes, of course, I'm a, a very offensive um, fullback, but um, I am also a, a tough player, very aggressive, and uh, I'm a team player, always fighting for, for the team. And what would you say your best attributes are? Difficult to say. Um, I would say, first of all, I'm a, I'm a very good defender before being a good offensive player because as a, as a right back, you, you're supposed to defend first. Uh, you spent a few years uh, with Newcastle um, as, as a very young player. How did you find that experience? Well, it was a great experience. Um, um, I think uh, I made a few mistakes over there and then I left England uh, as a kid and I'm back today as a, as a man and to, to prove the Premier League that um, I'm a great player and then uh, with Fulham that we can achieve uh, great things. Do you feel like you've kind of got unfinished business in the Premier League? Yes, of course. Uh, I didn't play enough games, so I'm here to, to, to improve my Premier League stats. And uh, do you know any of the guys in the squad? I know you played a few games with Alexander Mitrovic at Newcastle. Yeah, he's the only one I personally know. And uh, of course, I had uh, someone in common with uh, Harrison Reed, and uh, I saw him during my holidays in Portugal, and we had the, the time to chat a little bit. Did he say nice things about the club? Yes, he said it's a great place. He said just um, come to Fulham and help us to to stay in the league and uh, achieve great things with the club. Uh, speaking of uh, Mitro, um, Switzerland and Serbia are in the same World Cup group. Uh, how much are you looking forward to Qatar this winter? Of course, uh, it will be my first World Cup, so um, I'm very excited about it. And uh, But first of all, I have to... Get, um, get to know the club, uh, the players and focus in Fulham first and then the World Cup will come after that. I suppose that's a good motivation, isn't it? Because if you hit the ground running with Fulham, you'll be in good condition for when the World yeah, Cup exactly. comes Yeah, exactly. The, the goal now is to, is to get fit as soon as possible, to be fit for the team and then for the national team in uh, November. And do you know much about us as a club here at Fulham? Yes, of course. I know a few things. I know that uh, there's a style you never change, I think. Is that right? And there's a what, sorry? There's a stand you never change. Yes, the it's listed. Great to be yeah, listed. Yeah, very yeah, good. That's yeah. uh, the special thing I know about Fulham. And I also know that it's a traditional, traditional club and that there is well respected in, uh, in England. So what was it made that made you want to come to Fulham? What were the main factors for you? The main factors is that um, the club is uh, ambitious and um, this is also my personality. I'm a very ambitious person. I have high goals and um, I hope uh, we can achieve them together with the club so it will help also me to achieve my personal goals. And we try and play under Marco Silva, we played very attacking football last season as an attacking fullback, is that something you're looking forward to being a part of? Yes, of course, um, when I spoke with, uh, with the manager, um, I really I directly liked uh, his uh, philosophy of playing football. He told me that uh, he wants uh, his team to, to have the ball um, most of the time, so at least more than 50% of the time during the game. Uh, he wants to play from the back, he wants an offensive fullback. So I think this is a football that will uh, uh, suit me. And in your career, you've played European football, you've won domestic titles. So what sort of challenge do you think this is going to be at Fulham now? Um, well, the challenge, everybody knows it. It's uh, to, to stay in the Premier League. And I think that's the main goal for, for everyone. And uh, I think we have the the tools for it, um, the team is good, uh, some nice signings from what, I, from what I saw. So I'm uh, very positive and optimistic with uh, what we can achieve this season with Fulham. Yeah, I was going to say, what do you think we can achieve over our, our years together? But I suppose that's the first step and then hopefully build yeah, from Yeah, the first step is to, to, to stay in Premier League and then uh, stay stable in the league and then why not to, to aim for the, for the top 10 and maybe more. And it's our last pre-season friendly on Sunday against uh, Villarreal. Um, how nice would it be for you to feature in that and play at Craven Cottage and meet the fans for the first time? I've been waiting for this for, for a long time now. And um, yeah, first of all, I'm really looking forward to meet the team um, tomorrow. And then, of course, 
playing the, this special stadium, meet the fans, um, win against Villarreal and then build the confidence for, the, for next week against uh, Liverpool. Thank you for sitting down with us, Kevin, and welcome to Fulham. Thank you very much.